Welcome to episode four of the Disciple Podcast. With me is Dirty Phonics and John from Terra Vita. Bonjour and welcome. Bonjour. Bonjour. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Oui. Right, um, <laughs> so we, we always fuck around with envelopes. It's not going to bother this week because no one believes that I didn't write them. So this week's subject is food. Uh, John, what's the worst French food you've ever eaten? Charlie. Huh? Oh, wow, oh, that's that, a that pretty was, good answer. That no, was kind of quick. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was quick, but that, that we're on to subject number two, much quicker than I thought I would. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's <laughs> I'm not going to say much about that. Um, let's have a quick wa- word from... Um, I mean, come on, you didn't, you didn't have like escargot? I love escargot. Oh, okay. Realistically, I've never had bad French food. No. All right. Yeah, last, time, and, uh, last, time, last time you were in France, we had rock Oh my together. God, it was yeah, so oh, good. Yeah. It's just like a waterfall of cheese on like yes. anything. Just potatoes. I would never put cheese on a potato, but I, it was delicious. That's what we do. Yeah, yeah. cheesy fries. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, that's cheese on potatoes. Yeah. So that's, that's I'm trying to be less American in France. So yeah. yeah, fair enough. Cut me some slack, please. All right, fair enough. Uh, he puts ranch on his potatoes. I don't the even love that? no ranch. What? Get out of here with that shit. Fake American. Well, that, that brings us on nicely to the next subject, which, which, what's the worst American food that you guys have ever eaten? Wow. Processed cheese whiz. <laughs> yeah, no, true. Very true. I mean, I've never tried that. I tell you uh, what, I'm going to agree with you. That I'm supposed to be neutral, but that <laughs> when it when, when food comes out of a fucking can that's liquid at room yeah, temperature no, and that, it's not a drink, that doesn't make any sense. Granted, the convenience of putting yes. the can in your mouth is it's okay, but you're like doing whippets with cheese or something. Drug Just addict. Like, so oh, that's going to ring the ASMR. Oh, yeah. oh no, 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 no! no, no let's not do that again, please. <laughs> Hi, this well, is ASMR. We're gonna listen to this for an hour now. Oh, yeah. And I've gone to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we done. I was thinking about doing disciple ASMR videos actually for, oh, for yeah. some clickbait. Oh dude, hire him. And then we write a song yeah, and he gets all with I'm all down. the samples from it. No, I was just thinking about putting on YouTube. Oh, yeah. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Sorry for being creative. Just, just I guess I'll just be over here. <laughs> fucking big rhythm ASMR. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What's that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Yes. So um, we're going to try and talk a bit more about music. Mm-hmm. These episodes. This has probably been the number one feedback from dear viewers. Is we don't oh, actually fine. talk about anything about music on the music podcast of Disciple. So we will talk a bit. Uh, we'll start off, though, with your new single on Disciple. Yes. yes. Rise from the Dead. Yes. You, got any words? Uh, uh, brace yourself. Yep. Put some water on your uh, neck because it's going to hurt. Put, Put some, some water, water on, on your, your neck? neck? Watch this. <laughs>
It's pretty good. Ah, oh, banger. Ah. Thanks. It is pretty good. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty good. I, I, th I think one question that I think a lot of people might have, and I, I'm pretty interested in this. Whoop, shit. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm pretty interested as well. Is um, you're one of the few guys that have kind of made it from being like a legit drum and bass artist to kind of making your way over into dubstep, and that's not actually that common. So, tell us a bit about the process. Oh, tell me, that's tell the most me. interviewy question yeah, I've ever asked. That's yeah. like a real question. Guys, what was that like for you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah no, seriously, like, sort of talk, talk, tell everyone and kind of and me a little bit about kind of the years of transition. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's that's the right word. I mean, it, it, it's been like a 10 years long transition Process. kind of thing. Mm. But it's kind of funny because like we've, everyone saw us to start with as a drum and bass act, but mm. we never wrote drum and bass only. We've always like tried different things, whether it was drum and bass, dubstep, 110, some like 128 stuff. Yeah, I'm making like uh, hybrid tracks with like drum and bass intro, first drop is electro, second drop is drum and bass, and all you have like a dubstep part into it. Well, like so, yeah. It was really a lot of hybrid stuff. I, I guess it was the affiliation with audio porn and yeah. all that kind of stuff that really kind of set that home. I remember seeing the videos, and it was kind of like I remember like the, that big video you guys made or whoever made it for you, yeah. whatever. And it was kind of the the real, I guess, the pitch to the yeah, to the scene right. really of like check this sure. out. It's like the most ridiculous DJ. Yeah, I mean, sort of. and the challenge was like, okay, we love drum and bass is where we're coming from, but we really want to explore everything and. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if, I don't know, producing any kind of BPMs, like, I don't know, like, try new things and see, you know, who you are as a person, as an yeah. artist, and, yeah, just explore because it's just so much fun. And back in those days, it was the explosion of everything, you know, like, the big EDM, let's say, mm. everything, to all, all this old thing became, like, mainstream. Like yeah. throughout those days, it was just like well, it's, very, it's very forward thinking, if you know, because that's kind of common now. You know, yeah, exactly. Different yeah, genres. Yeah. It wasn't back then, especially not in the drum and bass community. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. that's the thing. Like, like sub focus and yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, of, back then, if you really like one drum and bass song, you were a drum and bass artist. Yeah, yeah. that yeah. that was it. Well, it's in a way, it's still a lot like that. You yes, know? It's, it is. It's a pretty you know focused genre. Yeah, true. But that's that's the funny thing. I mean, if you write a dubstep song and then after that you write a drum and bass song, you're you're a dubstep artist that you know wrote mm. a drum and bass song just like that. It's always a tricky one to that transition. Barely yeah. Alive smashed it. I think we can all agree on with the drum bass tune they made, but yeah, like getting dude. the drums right and drum yeah, and bass, yeah. especially as a dubstep producer, like, like you know, we were fucking failed drum and bass producers for years. I mean, <laughs> what do you I, mean? I, 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 I say, I say, no, yeah. Yeah. that's <laughs> how I like actually messed up my dubstep. That's how I dubstep. <laughs> I, I, I failed you know, at drum and bass. I have, you know, I played Belgium six times. Yeah, oh. like I said. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> So I think we should all have some whiskey. Yes. Um, all right. I, 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 this isn't like a particularly traditional whiskey glass, but um, traditional whiskey glasses don't sponsor oh, and, uh, stage production. So fuck it. Is a traditional yes, whiskey glass. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Actually, it's, it's a modern day traditional whiskey glass. Yeah. You've already got, is, you, you've already had enough, Sancho. First of all, I don't know why you're <laughs> judging me. No, no, you've got some. Um, do you oh, want some yeah, first? Oh. I was just like forcing it on you. This is Talisker. Uh -huh. it's, nice. it, it's good. Wait, does that mean I don't get any? Is that... No, you can have no. some Johnson. Okay. Why don't you mix it up, man? You can do some kind of right. Thanks, hybrid. Man. That's all right. You're funny enough. Drink. I mean, yeah. there's more glasses. Thank I'm you. Sure. Yes. Very much. More traditional whiskey uh, glasses yeah. here. Okay. What do you want? to Cup? You want me to call it cup? Ooh, cup. Yeah, yeah, really yeah, I like nice. cup. Yeah. Just absorb that out. What does it say about Boys, it? I, I, cheers. Bring it in. Cheers. 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 I, I'm cheersing with your glass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 I thought you had one. What is this? It's okay. We like you. Okay. All right. Very much. What you're. Yeah, it comes from like an island. That's very descriptive, Thank you. I guess. Cheers. Hey, hey, hey. Why, why do you nice. have a small cup? What's what's up with the... I'm I mean, you can I'm put very modest. the same Aww. amount of this in the mm. small cup. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, this is really nice. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was so, quite of a journey. And uh, it was like, you know, really, I don't know. Very... Uh, I don't know, like, a, how do you say? Like a, learn, like a big learning process. And, it was, uh, would so, you say it was a journey? Yeah, I mean, like mm. uh, in a production, a you know, Thank like you. level and stuff like that. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, reality is that our music reflects what we like and what we play on stage. Sure. Yeah, yeah of course. And living so. in the States, it's obviously going to be a reflection on, on a lot of kind of bass music focus these days. Yeah. Just, yeah, yeah. And so, that, that's what awesome. What, what's awesome about traveling everywhere is that depending on which continent or country you go to, yeah, the uh, general vibe and the... the the music that the, that the people like is different everywhere. Like sometimes it's, you know, more drum bass heavy, like you're up like their drum bass more, I guess, than in the US. Yeah. Um, but the funny thing is that, you know, it's always like the drum bass heads that are more vocal online. 
So you'll yes, hear everyone being like, drum and bass and Yeah. They're like, <laughs> yeah, they're like, they're like the two. Um, yeah, deaf. So yeah, everyone's like, oh, well, you know, oh, you, you, you can play like, I don't know, like 50 dubstep songs and then two drum and bass ones and everyone's going to be like, drum and bass, bro. Oh, man. <laughs> but it's switching. It's changing it really quick. Like countries like Austria or something like that, they were... When we were used to like go there and like play a show, it will be like, okay, cool, we're gonna play a lot of drum and bass because you know they dig it more. And it's not the case anymore. Yeah. Like it's just it like they really want both. Yeah. Like no, so, I mean especially Perth, that was kinda like the heart. I mean obviously Perth. No, 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 Australia. 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 I thought you said Australia. 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 Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> no, 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 yeah, but it's it's true too. It's true too. It's, it's a good example too. It's a good example too. Yeah, sorry, the but emphasis is when you're French is difficult. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Australia. Yeah. Yeah. So, how long have you guys been living out in the states for now? You're a bit longer than me. Four, four, yeah. four, four years. A little bit over your, over four years. Cool. Correct. Oh, yeah. about the same. Well, Ross, <laughs> yeah. Ross is about five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm four and a half. Uh, John's probably most out of everybody. The fuck does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> it means everything you want to put behind. It means that you, that it was, I'm it was, old. Is that what you're no, you just calling meant, me? No, you're American. It okay. was. It was a really simple right, joke. There wasn't much to it. Whatever. Never mind. Sorry. Right. Anyway, <laughs> I mean, as European, we're laughing. I'm sorry. Are you drinking in my cup? No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Thanks. I feel like oh, that's shit, a thing. I, like, <laughs> I feel like that's wow. the thing French people do. Double yes. fisting already. Haha, -ha, French joke. Speaking of things French people do, <laughs> do, you, do you guys cook a lot? I, yes. 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 Yeah. You do. Yeah. I figured you might. I, I used to, and I've just become incredibly lazy recently. Mm, not as lazy what? as Dan. But that's just that's just, yeah. <laughs> just Dan already left and you're just beating him. I do it if he's here. I think it's it's a fact. He walked out without saying goodbye to anybody. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I said goodbye through the window. And he was enough. like, like yeah. But yeah, we yeah. we do cook a lot, um, A because it's in our blood culture. Yeah. Uh, and also because it's fucking awesome to be able to be at home and do something like homey. So yeah. you know, instead of like eating at the restaurant, sleeping in a hotel, it's like sleeping in your bed and cooking. Whoa, yeah. that's awesome. Yeah. So yeah, um, I do a lot of crepes. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're really hammering over the stereotypes here. No, I mean yes and yes. It's true. Though. I like crepes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. The transition was right. Yeah. 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 I really, I really like the silence before. <laughs> Double I'm doing with Pony crepes. Yeah, it's amazing. Needed yeah. some introduction, but Wash yeah. them down with Bordeaux. Is this, uh, this is an so, Italian I, mean, I think thing, it's huh? safe to yeah. say you guys are probably at the higher echelons of the disciple cooking thing. Who do you think would come last if we had a cooking competition out of all of disciples? John. <laughs> Wrong. Is John talking about I've never, I've never experienced okay. it. Okay, all right. Yeah. You should probably ask Kaylee. Oh, Good. yeah. Kaylee, what's John's cooking like? Amazing. Right. Oh, wow. yeah. Okay. You're, I am the cook in the house. Wrong. No, he's really good. I have experiences. Oh, yeah. okay. I have, yeah. I have it's, fed it's pitch and bonkers. You're going to get invited wow, for, pitch yeah. is lucky. Uh, for yeah. uh, reasons like just what you said to me. Yeah. <laughs> well, my, my vote goes, it's a joint award, really, between Ross and Dan, uh, but they all pale in, in insignificance to an old flatmate I had. This, this, this is the worst chef I've ever had. And I know we're supposed to be a disciple on point, but this is the worst. So I, I live with this Irish guy called Dave, okay. who had never cooked before, been very overmothered, rich parents, all this kind of stuff. And once I taught him... <laughs> You could cook potato waffles in a toaster. And that's all he had <laughs> of course, for the next year. Of course, year. this went to potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So, yeah, Dan's, Dan's like one rung above that, I think. Dan, Dan is on get kind of, you He's know. He's one I mean, I rung remember... above toaster potatoes. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> yeah, so that would probably be, yeah. So it's quite the pedigree. I remember your guys' fridge when you guys first moved in. And oh, basically Jesus. you could cook... Beer with beer inside. <laughs> yeah, that was kind of <laughs> best in, in dish the ever. House, yeah. <laughs> Dieter, is it? Has it moved on much these days? It has probably got a lot better. No, it's no, you, it's you and Pat. Come on, <laughs> and Ross. We did a lot of barbecues, and we've seen this, the the food, the cooking level so, going up and up and up and up. So why don't we on. do like a disciple cookout thing, and everyone Wait, cooks and brings that. something? And don't then, we do those? You know, we should do it on the stream. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we could have like yes. little, you know, cardboard pieces with like luck. grains little and yeah. shit. Pot luck. Barbecue. I yeah. bet you there's got to be a, there's got to be like a, a Twitch category. You know for what? Like this is going to get yeah, yeah. aggressive though, because people Why? are going to start showing up with like baked Alaska and fucking. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Dude, you're going to be popcorn. What are you talking about? <laughs> Have you ever had my popcorn? Delicious. Yeah. No. No. I mean, <laughs> he's going to be a challenge. That question. <laughs> <laughs> That's so, a weird. Yeah. There could be in a lot of stuff, right? I know. <laughs> What's popping? What's I am. How, how about that corn? Huh? <laughs> On the <laughs> corn. What are you even fucking talking about? So I've got a note here that you guys sent me. Um, it says, "Ask you about the beatbox story of last weekend." Oh, sounds ominous, dude. All right, um, take it was, away. Yeah, I mean, there is a, apparently like a, 
How do you say that? malediction? Can you say that in English? I don't think so. Malediction. How do you say that? A curse. There's a curse. Yeah, yeah there's good. a curse yeah, on yeah. us, I guess. Yes, I like how you looked at play, me like yeah. I was going to translate a French word for you. <laughs> good luck. <laughs> Sounds a little like malevolence. That but, maybe uh, doesn't have an English an English no, word to it. You, You're like, you, can, you can make up words too yeah. if you yeah. want. It's okay. Sandwich. Nailed <laughs> 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 But yeah, so apparently, I mean, I don't know, the last past two times we played in Netherlands, we had like a very long technical issues at the beginning of our set. And it just happened again uh, last weekend or something yeah. like that. Yeah, we played Eindhoven. Yes. And uh, fire alarm is going on. Everything is like all lit, you know, like everybody is like. So yeah, you're about to get on stage. Yeah. The full club, like, you know, house lights are on and you're like, hey, CDGs don't work. Nothing works. And only the microphone is working. So yeah. Oh, yeah. we I've, give I've some water there. to the kids and like, you know, like it's cool to Say party. Say a couple of non-funny jokes. Yeah, like, you know, embarrass <laughs> ourselves. Yeah. The, the, the eliminate approach. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Except at the beginning of the night while we're in the end. <laughs> Stick around. And yes, yeah, and uh, Muzzy is like looking at me, is like, can you beatbox or something? I'm like, no, I can't beatbox for shit. And I'm like, hold on. I'm sure in this, like, I don't know, like thousands of people here, there was one dude who were able to kill it. So we took the mic, it's like, yo, bring me someone who's gonna be able to beatbox. And Mike, beatbox Mike, came on stage. <laughs> beatbox Mike. Dude, beatbox he Mike. literally killed it. Like every the entire crowd was like cheering, hands up. I couldn't believe that thing was happening. Huh. And it was just the best thing to put everybody back in the right mood after me like all paced and you know like this is not working That's and perfect timing the, the 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 lights come back down the music is back up and perfect introduction for our set so i think there's a is there a video Mike. of this on yes our Instagram? yeah we posted okay. a video of it and stuff it's That's just cool. yeah maybe producer data can find it no uh, yeah it's it's <laughs> it was pretty epic yeah. big up mike Fair, killed I've, it. I've had a few situations like that and I'm, i've dealt with them far less well Oh, it's no. the same. It's usually the same jokes. It's like, uh, has anyone got any coal? I think the generators <laughs> run out. <laughs> I mean, like those imp like, <laughs> improvised kind of stuff made it really special. And yeah. for everybody, like everybody will will remember. Oh, that day yeah, was fucking. Good. Mike came on stage and literally, it was. He's a professional big, big, beatboxer. Big box Mike. Yeah, big box yeah. Mike. Yeah, yeah. Mike called it Wait, on is the it mic. Big box or beatbox Mike? Beatbox. <laughs> beatbox <laughs> Mike. God, this is like. Great. Yeah. Shout out to it's you, like Mike. Australia yeah, all over enough. again. But yeah, you know what? It's funny because like it starts with a technical difficulty, and at the end of the day, whatever happened before we started playing made that night even more special. Yep. Yeah, you know, it was like you know humans getting together and having fun. Yeah, this is the like, yeah simple. exactly. That was the most important part. Like yeah. everybody can get frustrated. And it's how you can have like situation get out of control and stuff like that. But it's just it's good to bring back to like all right, guys, we are all here together to fucking party. So let's yeah. just have fun and just you know he came up, he killed it. Cool, but like, you know, perfect nice. vibe, let's do it. And now John's gonna beatbox for the next 10 minutes. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> See, James not working, guys. It's just like, I don't know, it's just, uh, it's just. It's, it's off, just not it's working. Off. That's it's just it. not working. John, you're gonna have to fill it out. <laughs> this is a microphone. <laughs> Mike. Oh. oh, here we go, Jake. <laughs> How was that? Was that? You gotta do that. Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> I can't do it. That's it's something like that. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that, was, that, was, that was a great example, Rob. Thank you. <laughs> Continue with that. It's, it's, it's on par. No, it's not. Beatboxing has never been yeah. a, my forte. Yeah, fair. Hmm. Well, speaking Ooh. of forte, okay, Kermit, calm down. The guys have brought in a whip for all you guys to listen to that's yeah. never been heard before outside of their studio. Uh, it's called uh, Dirty Ladon Megaphonics 13.wav. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> the it's best the final track title. title. <laughs> final track title. That's right. my last word. <laughs> Do you want to, do you want to like say anything about it? Or? Uh, pretty simple. It's uh, it's a tune that we started with uh, Mega mm -hmm. We toured together in Australia yeah. uh, <laughs> and New Zealand uh, <laughs> about last year, probably. And, uh, you know, same simple story of like, hey, you cool, you cool. You want to make some music? Yeah, sure. So, yeah, we started this. Um, definitely not on for now, but... Um, yeah, don't know where it's going, but... Exclusive. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Straight back into another question. Yeah, 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 yeah. There you go. <laughs> nice. Everything should start with an air horn. It's like, morning. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, dude, I would love that. Not. That's my kind of shit in the morning. Worst alarm morning. ever. Oh, we should do it when people come into the office. Now we've got quite a few employees. That should Every be your time doorbell. Just change the doorbell. Yeah. That should be the oh doorbell. My God, that's fucking genius. Every time someone opens the door, that is a cool. great idea. All All right. Right. We're, we're going to do that. D, make a note. <laughs> <laughs> Producer right, D, right, write that down. <laughs> write that shit down. Um, so, um, I should ask you guys about renting a motorcycle in India. Oh, this definitely not scripted question that I no. Oh, just new to I mean, asking. <laughs> you want to take it away? I don't know. No, do you do it? All right. So we played a show. We played a festival in India two years is ago. Is that maybe three years story? Ago. Yeah, I guess. I don't. Yeah, go it's for it. A good story. Um, oh yeah, the end is good. So yeah. Anyways, playing a show in India, <laughs> super <laughs> awesome festival. <laughs> really set him up there. Yeah. It's like, yeah just, just, just skip for it. Yeah, and now um, <laughs> sit back and relax. Yeah. Enjoy the show. And that was him, the murderer. Um. What Thanks. Fuck? Okay. Anyways. Yeah, win them all, man. So, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're playing. Uh, Put some water on your neck. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded way better in French. Anyways, <laughs> played a festival a couple years ago in India, and and the thing is, like, when Pitch and I travel, um, you know, especially like places we've never been to or far away places, we love to take a moment to try to discover some of the culture. Yeah. So you know, whether we have two hours to spare or a few days. Want to get out there and see what's up around. So, and we like to rent motorcycles, which and, is the main thing. Yeah, really, exactly. To be so we're outside the hotel and we see all these guys that are renting motorcycles. So a very legit place out in the streets. The guys are like, give me, you know, $20, leave your passport and come back whenever you want kind okay. of thing. Those and, three words would have scared. <laughs> yeah. just, just having you, that would have been yeah. a red flag. Leave that's exactly what passport. you did. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but dude, they, have, they yeah. have like Royal Enfield motorcycle, the 500, you know, the such a classic one. I'm going to nod it. my head and pretend I know what you're talking about to look cool. Oh, come on. Yeah. You're English. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, well, I'm no, about favorite that. motorcycle. All right. All right. <laughs> anyway, that's legendary fucking motorcycle. No, I'm sure it, sound, it sounds legendary. Is it like the one the ones that would have been in like The Great Escape? Yes, yes, pretty much. Yes, pretty Nailed much. It, pretty oh, much. See, see, you're good. Nailed it. Anyway, so, sorry, uh, yeah, on. so we were like, all right, cool, let's do it. We have like four hours before we got to fly. So let's do it. Live with a bike, go to a little market, maybe like half hour away from where we were staying at, you know, try different spices and buy a couple souvenirs from family and shit. <laughs> yes. We're just and, like um, dipping your fingers in spices. The, the spi <laughs> just, just find the different spices. That's 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 key for Wait, what's going to happen. I have one question though. Uh, yeah. Did you rent one bike or two bikes? One. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> one. Charlie's always in the back. Man, I'm just going real close. I'm just, yeah. I'm the driver. Just to clarify, what you that's is, I, is that how you call it, the hugger? I don't. I'm not. I'm not like this. <laughs> uh, from this, this, this point, point, can we do the tonight? That is how. That is how you say it from this point on. Yeah, the hugger. Okay. All right. Yeah. So a doggy hugger. Um, so yeah, you know, <laughs> go to the market, train some different like foods and stuff. Fuck. And, um, uh, it's time to go back to the hotel, grab our suitcases and, uh, go to the airport. And we're like, let's try the highway. So we go on the highway, start riding for a little bit for like 10, 15 minutes. And then the bike goes like, ah, Grow down. So you can't beat bucks. That that was that was pretty good. Yes, I know. Yes. I know. I got this shit. Felt like I was in the field <laughs> many times. Oh, hey. I can't sample that. Wow. <laughs> so you know, I'm behind him. Like, what the fuck's going on? Is like, I don't know. Whatever. Let's stop for a second. Long story short, we figure out we're out of gas in the middle of fucking India, and we got two hours to spare. So we're like, oh God. dude, what do we do? Start trying to like stop cars. No one would stop. No. We have no idea where we Two are. Two French people waving at cars in the middle of India. Like, <laughs> yeah. no, nobody's like, yeah, nobody's stopping. Hey, friends. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Pageant, pageant wave. People listen like pressing gas even faster. You're like, oh, shit. I know. So somehow there is this empty bottle of Coke waiting on the street for us. And we're like, well, I mean, we don't know what we're going to be doing, but we need a container to bring gas back to the bike. Grab the thing, keep hitchhiking, and that old dude stops the car and is like, in this crooked ass English, I'm not saying man is better, but you know, try to communicate the fact that we're out of gas and we wanna to go to the gas station. So the guy's like, yeah, I'll take you. So I'm like, all right, cool, I'll come with. And Pitchin's like, dude, we're in the middle of India, I'm not gonna let you, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, eh, you know what, we'll, we'll be safe, it's fine. 
So we go there and myself and Bizzle, so Pitchin's staying with a bike. By myself in the middle of nowhere and on the highway. <laughs> and, and I'm in this <laughs> with car. With no passport. Yeah, no, right. no phone <laughs> service, no, no passport, exactly. And I'm in this like shitty car, we could say with this guy and we're starting to like, you know, exchange like, hey, what are you doing? Is like, I'm dr- going to get my daughter or niece, whatever uh, at school. Um, and yeah, he finally dropped me at a gas station. So I'm there with my few Indian what is it? Rupees? I think it's or rupees. 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 Okay, yeah, cool. Well, we just bought some clothes and stuff online, so that's how I know that. Okay, yeah. all right. So a few rupees, and I'm like showing this guy at the pump station. I'm like, well, this is what I have, and this is my bottle. You know, do whatever you can. Um, probably got like, what, a liter or two? That's like half a gallon, I guess. Anyway. Quarter, oh. quarter of a gallon. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Oh, hold on. Quarter of a US gallon, a fifth of a British gallon. So, you know, this is just imagine the rush and the anxiety of like going to There's a stranger a car in this story. try to get some gas. He needs to take a shit so fucking bad. <laughs> if Finally, you can call it like that. Yes. I, well, I mean, you know this what? is exactly what Plain happened English, for real. We've gotten there. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Finally get back. I'm like the car, see the car coming back. He's like with the bottle of like gas, not even with the top on. I'm like, oh my God, I'm like, we're going to make it. Put some gas in a motorcycle, drove as fast as possible because Charlie had to like, Take a poop. Take Grab a- my suitcase at the hotel. Yeah, it was like a poop. It was that like more like a, a piss from somewhere. I mean, I don't know. So yeah, you guys get it. It's aggressive. So yeah, it's yeah, aggressive. Anyways, <laughs> we made it. We got back on our flight and back home and... um that's and you destroyed that's, it. Yeah, yeah, you killed it. I guess. Uh, are we it. talking about the bathroom still? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, oh, you know, was... once again, that's what make a trip. Um, that's what make makes memories for life. Yeah, yeah. shitting your pants. This is what makes memories for sure. Here's <laughs> to shit in your pants. Let's yeah. shit your pants. To, All right, yeah. boys. <laughs> to shit in your yeah. pants. Yeah. All right. Up, 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 mostly up. To, Char- mostly night, to Charlie. I think it's your turn for a whip. Ah. <laughs> music. Okay. Yeah. So, oh, I can hear it. Right now. Mm. Yeah, no, it's, it's a nice lounge. Is it weird that I've actually been nodding my head to like... <laughs> I, 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 I did that the whole time. You guys that time just over here like... Oh, man. People on this which, stream must think I'm like fucking weird or something. Dude, which, <laughs> which four are we on? <laughs> like, we, 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 yeah, just rent through this episode with no background music. <laughs> <laughs> just, 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 just over here like, just, just, like twitching in the corner okay. a little bit. <laughs> you know, that's the thing. Like, every Ross is fucking asleep, so... Oh, this guy cut the story short because I saw Rossi falling asleep. He literally fell asleep. I know. So I was like, okay, this is fucking boring. <laughs> no, it wasn't, though. It was a good story. It was a good Ross story. Was just tired. My question is everyone's um, uh, pretty uncomfortable when it comes to like being in an elevator with uh, strangers. So, what if you put mics and headphones? Would you make a podcast in an elevator? Does that make sense? I mean, that, wait, where where would you, you, so people just come in and you're like, you how's it going? Yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. I think no, you got the music in the background, you're like, hey, hi. Just hit the stop yeah. button, people. Welcome probably to the call the floor. police real quick. You gotta catch, I mean, you gotta wait for the door to shut, so you, can, if, you gotta be pretty innocuous to be when you have to be, which floor? Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. And once it closes, like, so? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know that it What's the worst French food you've ever eaten? Yeah, nice. Anyway, so I'm glad I brought it back to the food topic before this. Am I doing good, Ross? Keeping it on topic? He wouldn't know. Yeah, that's a very affirmative <laughs> yeah. nod. I, I mean, we, we, we've been talking about music the whole time. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, we have been talking about music yeah. and food. Mm-hmm. Sort of. Uh, right, so <laughs> we've got a whip that yes. Chris, your partner in crime, <laughs> sent over. Yeah. It's called Terra Vita. Get out of here. 174-3. Oh, this is a VIP that uh, we've been... That we not been working i'm pretty sure it's finished but um <laughs> it is, uh, that we made it the last two we put out on round table get out because um we want to play it but it doesn't flow well in our sets we mm-hmm. like to switch tempos a lot so when we're talking about drum and bass with dirty phonics yes we yep. want to play at that speed a lot so this is something that we want to play of ours that we can change to get into our tempo for drum and bass so this is what we used last show in bangkok and it seemed to work well the disciple show in bangkok yeah uh drum and bass is also quite in our blood yay so it's a tempo ramp uh well you know it's drum step okay drum and bass Uh, somebody's at the door just yeah It's pretty like good. Colgate. It's kind of okay.
take a picture of it. Do you want to do it? It's 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 yeah. on, of course he wants to do it. He's going to spill a drink. If I reach over there, Annoying. something's going to break. He's going to spill a drink on the CDJ. Annoyingly, this thing this is, is what he does on stage all the time. So velocity good. sensitive. Hey, Ross, let me try that. I need this in my life. You can't turn velocity sensitive off. It didn't work. Yeah, did. the it, was wrong really, it, was, it was really quiet. <laughs> oh, no. So you should press it quietly. <laughs> that was the one I was <laughs> looking for. It's pretty good. Okay. Anyway, um, so Chris, um, uh, John, even did you just? Chris told me to. That's what I meant to start with. Fuck oh, off. Have you been drinking? Uh, it's unprofessional. Yeah. <laughs> so Chris, Chris told me to ask you about the time you spent a night on a park bench in London. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. I want to hear this. Can I have another whiskey, please? Yes. Uh, and do you want another whiskey, music. John? Uh, no. I'm, no, because that's, uh, that, that's uh, how we ended up. So, <laughs> on a bench. Uh, I, I honestly don't remember like too much about what can, happened can earlier that night. Can you to your microphone, please? What? Thank you. Can you not hear me? Uh, your, no. your mic's to the side. Yeah, well, that, maybe that's, if, that's, uh, that's what I thought you were meant things. to be a fucking vocalist. What's going on with your mic technique? Shut up, bro. I pulled it. <laughs> um, so yeah, I don't really like remember what had happened earlier, but we went. So we ended up at my my buddy Tony's house, who runs like the A and R for a major label, and we were young, and we were like, oh, this is fucking such a great how, opportunity. How young? When was this exactly? Uh, this was actually for Hopping <laughs> DeLorean <laughs> and not Terra Vida. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, so this was probably in like 2009, 2010, okay. somewhere around there. 10 years ago. And yeah. uh, we were Holy in London, shit. and you know, we went out for the night with the guys with our management and with him and we had this great night we ended up back at his flat uh in london and it was like that really posh section uh with like the huge brick flats that are like, like three floors. bridge or chelsea or... chelsea it was in chelsea okay, yeah and uh i had had too much to drink <laughs> and i went outside doesn't sound like you no, no. not even <laughs> uh, so it i went a outside long time ago. to throw up and I was out front and this like guy on a motor scooter comes flying down the street and dumps his shit into a car and crashes. And <sighs> it's like half a block down the street and the bike falls on top of him. So I was Whoa, like, what? what the fuck? So I run down to like help the guy out and I help him. I pull up the, the, the scooter off the top of him and he gets up and he seems to be okay. He gets back on his bike and drives away. Wow, and okay. I'm fucking trashed. And I hmm. turn around and Every single one of these houses <laughs> looks <laughs> exactly oh, the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see where this is They're going a couple of seconds early. All yep. the same. So, like, I made an effort and I knocked on like one or two doors, and the first two nobody answered. The third one, somebody screamed at me, <laughs> and I just walked away. And then I realized that my phone was dead, so I couldn't call anyone. And we were flying home the next day. <laughs> and uh, I kind of just wandered wow. until I found like a, a park bench. It was like right across the street from Victoria Station. Wow. Oh, wow. And oh, uh, man, I just laid down for the night. What what month of the year <laughs> is that? Yeah. It was in, during summer. Okay. Yeah. So I, I was all right. Uh, and then uh, the next morning, I obviously woke up early to yeah. people. Yeah. <laughs> 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 giving you uh, a few pounds. Thank God at the time there were still pay phones. Oh, right, wow. yeah, uh, yeah. So I found a payphone and I called Chris and like they came and scooped me and I managed to make my flight home, so, so which was his, like you knew within, his number. It was within, yeah, wow. exactly. yeah, yeah. Was about back in the era yeah. when people knew people's well, Chris, Chris, Chris is not, we've been we've been working together for you know yeah. seventeen some odd years. So his number is one of the only like three numbers Dude, I have memorized. I know this is. Right, okay. I know his yeah. number. So, it's the I don't only know his number. number. Yeah. So I don't I, know his number. That's how I spent the night on a park bench in London. Wow. Well, if there's ever been better proof for karma not existing. It's, it's the man going to aid the fallen motorcyclist. <laughs> He's spending a night on a park bench uh, as a consequence. No Fuck. good deed goes unpunished, correct? <laughs> yeah. I don't know that I would have found, in the defense, I don't know that I would have found my way back anyways, but that didn't help. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, wow. Shout yeah, out to Chris for that story. one. Thanks, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. That's super cool of you. He said to... he held back on other optional stories. So well, yeah, nobody got, wants to go to jail, man. Um, <laughs> do, you, do, you still, do you still remember Chris's phone number right now? Yeah. All right, what is it? Yeah, 617. Nine six seven. Thank you. Yeah, you're Thank welcome. you very much. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right. Um, well, we've got a bit of a Send him dick pics. <laughs> we did yeah. that last time on the on the podcast, uh, not on the podcast, on the Discord. He got several. It's great. <laughs> awesome. Nice. Can you sign a little form saying you're going to take full responsibility for that phone number we just handed mm, out? Nope. Edit that out, Dieter. <laughs> 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 Producer. <laughs> 
All right, we're gonna we're gonna end with a little game. We're gonna uh, basically go round uh, the some of the disciple acts, and um, you're gonna basically take a vote on if they were a dessert. Can you see how we just shoehorned this completely in to make yeah, it fit 100%. with the subject? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what? Uh, if they're a dessert, what dessert would they be and why? Uh, and, and and if if it's like more than one person in the group, you have to think of like a pairing. Why do I feel like I know who this is going to start with? Oh, man. I haven't actually thought that far through. One, one, actually, no, no, it wouldn't be very host-like. Is it another so card against humanity kind of thing? No, no, no. It's going to be <laughs> so no, bad. I, I'll, I'll speak in, in, in easy words for you, Pitchin. Thank I'll, you. I'll pick, I'll pick, I'll pick, I'll pick an easy one. What about... Uh, <laughs> Sandwich. <laughs> is there an easy one to describe as a... Uh, I'll just, I'll start off random. I'll start phase one. Graham, what, what, what... Vegemite. That's not a dessert. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, a dessert? <laughs> Only people would say that. Graham is... Okay, I, I, if that's a dessert to Graham you... Graham is an eclair. And why? Huh? Because he's always you have to got... Justify he's it. always got you white creamy just... stuff coming out of him. Pretty much. All right, let's move on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> virtual riot. Oh, oh wow. Black forests. What, because uh, it was different layers? Ge- Wait, geographical. Is that a black forest yeah, ham? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A black forest ham? Excuse what are you talking about? I have about? a bit of culture. <laughs> yeah, you know, that's fair. A strudel. A, a strudel. A sh- 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 strudel. That's racist. I, I, oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> only, in, only in America. Uh, <laughs> very true. <laughs> very true. So if you have to try it, I will say it's a milfoy because it's really like, you know, there is a lot of layers. M- mill. Mm. You know what I mean? 1,000. No. 1,000. Yeah, I don't know what I mean. All right. Very no, true. Yeah, I was no, just true. trying to think of the only like German a sweet cake, thing that so I knew. It's so well engineered. So that didn't help exactly. at all. Exactly. Thank what you. do you know? Sausage? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> don't, please don't look at me. I feel very uncomfortable right now. After saying sausage. <laughs> you sausage. say that, but I don't think that you feel that. We need a sausage button. <laughs> sausage. 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 No, I've only got this one. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> barely alive. Pumpkin pie. Boston yes. cream donut. Yeah. Spot on. Not bad. Everyone, yeah. Everyone's coming up with the geography today. Yeah. Hey, man, that's all I got here. <laughs> all right. Uh, Fox Stevenson. Huh. Mm. Has to be fruity. Really? Does Britain yeah, even have a fruity. dessert? We <laughs> 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 well, use the word pudding Just for everything. Just like sweet yeah. meat pie. Yeah. It's all. Beans. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you deserve something you fancier than that. Oh, come on. These don't all have to be ge- geographical kind of things. Oh. You can think of something that symbolizes them. Yeah, no, uh, I mean, um, you, you know want? what? A lemon meringue pie. Mm, wrong button. Oh, yeah, I like that. Okay, lemon yeah, white. I yeah. like that. He's blonde. I and know, he's I sweet. Know. Yes, yes, I agree. I agree. That's nice. We'll leave it on that. I That's agree. a nice touch. All right, mode step. Huh. Ooh, um, depends on who. I hey, whoa, whoa, you gotta come with the, <laughs> you gotta come with the pairings. So, um, yeah. Oh man. Okay. All right. I got one. Oh, sh- I don't know how you say this in English. A banana so, split. What's the? Um... <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right, fine. Fine. <laughs> A banana uh, split. What would you be in French? Yes. Uh, une île flottante. What? It's like floating island. I don't know what. <laughs> but why? Why is that pairing? <laughs> Because is, like Josh the would be the, the whipped cream <laughs> like on the, the top. I'm trying to and imagine that is the liquid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What? Why? This is the weirdest. One's like producer light. data. Can you get up? Uh, can you spell this for producer data? Of course. Uh, what, it, what is it? So what is it's I L E space. I. He's, he's trying to work no. out how to upgrade Internet Explorer. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> so. <laughs> I-L-E space F-L-O-T-T-A-N-T-E. I will say the exact opposite. I will say the liquid part is Josh, the base, and and the foamy, funny, goofy thing on top floating around, it's Pat. I see what you're saying, but I you know? no? disagree. Tiramisu. Right. No. Oh. Sure. They are layers. Nah, no, 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 no. Dude, come on, no. Il flottante. Il flottante. Well, it's, I mean, um, this, is, this is American There's like Google. custard, yeah. and like <laughs> liquid custard in the bottom, and then there, it's like- Whose liquid custard is it? Josh's yeah. or Pat's? <laughs> it's Pat. Okay. Well, to okay. me, it's Pat. To him, it's Josh, but whatever. Okay, so... And then there's... Okay, hold on. Hold on. I got to find this for you guys. Right. F- find something Oh, yeah, different. this. Oh, that's... Yeah, okay. Yeah. No, what, do you, what do you call this in English? Mode step. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. Oh, yeah. the timing. Perfect. No, I don't know. I, I have no idea. I've never seen that before. It looks tasty. Maybe it looks it's really good. good. It's okay, French. you know it's what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's called the cream. floating island. The floating island. That's, that's mm. what they call it. I mean, Google says floating island. All right. And if you don't know, now you know. I'm glad Moving that you on, refrained from syndicate. ending that sentence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, virus syndicate. Mm-hmm. Mm, okay. they're, they're, they're not a dessert. They're just two hot they dogs. Are not two a hot dessert. dogs in a bun. Yeah, yeah. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> one hot dogs one bun, bun, two hot dogs. <laughs> and and John sure. knows about this. Yeah, 100%.
Wow. wow. <laughs> All right, well, let's do you next. What are you? That's aggressive. You want to do me, Rob? Oh, man. I can't think of a witty response to that. What pudding would you be? Ha. <laughs> huh. Dessert, whatever. I would be a gingerbread man, obviously. <laughs> oh. All right. What would I be? Something sour. <laughs> oh, sure. <laughs> All right, how about, how about you two? You can self-title, oh, or unless John can think of anything. Um, lady fingers. Did, no, <laughs> <laughs> this is it. This no. podcast, you know, is over. Oh, wow. <laughs> Drops the mic. Yeah, yeah. I don't think we can top that one. Well, we, we've got other artists to go, but I, I think you know, entertaining. I think I already. No, we're, we're, what we're, the fuck the this show has turned into? <laughs> Um, all right, guys. Well, thanks very much for coming on. This has been a lot of fun. Thank um, you for having us. Can we yeah. come back next week? Uh, you can come in. Come in when you have your next release. So if right. you make another tune by next week, you can come back in next week. Yeah. All right. Done. Cool. So everyone, go and check out the uh, new Dirty Phonics tune. Yes. It's called Rise from the Dead. Yes. <sighs> Scary as fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Symbolism. Cool. Thank you to Dirty Phonics and to John from Terra Vita for coming oh, on. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, hi, John. <laughs> John, <laughs> John, your last EP was fantastic as well. Thank you. I appreciate yeah. that. We'll thanks, have you Dodge. on for the next one. Yeah. No worries. Yeah. yeah hurry cool. up. Okay, cool. So yeah. we'll get that to you. See you next time. I need this in my life. You're having an only phone. No, no.